Hij vogeltjes pakken deze. Oh, kijk. It's a beautiful morning. I've had a cold sore for the past, well, this is day three, and I've just not been wanting to like really be on camera, like close up, because I just, it looks so motherfucking gross. But I'm having a really nice morning with Blue. We just cut his nails, and we cleaned his paws, we cleaned his eyes, his wrinkles, put on wrinkle cream, put on 
snout soother i think that's what it's called and then he started going crazy on here if you follow me on instagram i think i'm gonna post like a clip of it on my story if i don't then he was going crazy but follow me on instagram anyway <laughs> i'm gonna talk like this because it's just so gross i hate cold sores and i get them like i feel like i'm i haven't had one recently but i think it's just because when my immune system's a bit low um and the weather has been so up and down i think that maybe they just randomly come up for me but Boogies. Let's see, do we have any eye boogers? Oh, the sun is shining on you. Prettiest sunrise right now. I don't even think the camera is picking it up. Because it's like really bright. The sun is rising. And I'm so grateful that I get to live in this apartment. And I feel like... Even though I've been talking about like wanting to move and stuff, I think I also really need to like sit and appreciate these moments and just feel the gratitude. But do yay? Hey, 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 hey. And just like waking up with Blue, like he's just literally the cutest thing ever. I love him so much. And he brings me so much joy. Like, um, he needs to go pee. I did a little makeover on my balcony. Let me know if you like me vlogging kind of this way instead of always, like, showing my face. I think it's maybe nice for you guys to see more of my surroundings a little bit. I think there's, like, poop on the tile right there from him. So because we live so high up... Okay, we're... <laughs> Because we live so high up, um, I can't get down fast enough for him to, like, pee. So, like, I plan my walks with him, but then if he needs to pee or poop in between, he can just go on the balcony, which I think is very nice, and it just helps because also sometimes the weather is just too bad, and he hates the wind, and it gets windy quite a lot so sometimes we can't go out and then he at least gets to go pee and poop on the balcony which is the most important thing so yeah ew he pooped everywhere oh god he's just shitting everywhere okay guys we need to go clean this up <gasps> whoa like that is just so beautiful
so i made this it doesn't oh wait i made this like oatmeal it was a cookie recipe but then i kind of wanted to make it into this like i don't know what to call this i just like kind of put it on a baking uh baking tray that's what it's called and i like pressed it together and then after it was done in the oven i just kind of like tried to break it into different pieces and then when i want to go eat it i just heat it up for like a minute so that it's nice and warm and it's fucking bomb it's kind of good i don't know it's not necessarily healthy but it's good for like in the morning when i'm not really hungry i feel like i'll still like eat this and then i can take my meds and yeah I don't know if i put them on right but i put on some under eye patches <laughs> i think i didn't put them on right i don't know but they feel good and i put on this like keels like eye cream thing i look kind of weird but it's whatever also you will see me in a hat for i don't know how long because i have a bald spot on my head i will maybe show it soon i don't know <laughs> if i'm ready but um i it's i mean i have to update you guys on a lot if you did not watch my nail vlog i got covid and i was sick for like probably like a week i've been doing a lot better now i'm just like slowly getting back from it but i just like ended up like after i felt better from covid i was like okay let me wash my hair because i hadn't washed my hair for the whole week and then i was like sh like shading my hair and i looked at the top of my head and i was like since when do i have a bald spot and i literally have a bald spot like right in the middle like and my parting it's a problem so we're working on that but in the meantime i'm just gonna be wearing hats and i'm probably gonna try and find some new hats maybe i don't know so i can change them around and headbands because yeah that's the situation um i am about to go walk blue and yesterday so i'm just going to share this with you guys right away because i think it's fun and it's like why not so yesterday i got my lashes done because after i was sick like most of my lashes fell out and i think i might like learn how to do lashes i don't know i feel like it would actually be like really nice and i've just done some of my research on it and i've been like looking to do something that's not on social media that i can like do just to kind of get a different grasp of life because i truly have been doing this since i was like 17 18 like i feel like i haven't had like um like a more normal job but i wanted to like find something that i could do on the side that would just be a bit different that wouldn't like be completely focused on social media like even though i would still probably post my work like it just wouldn't be like that's like the main Thing. like i actually i'm learning something and i'm creating something on someone's eyes and like my lash tech i've been going to her for a while like over a year now and we're basically like friends like i feel really comfortable around her and she was talking about how she needed more lash techs so then i was like okay so there's demand as well right that's important and i feel like it would actually be kind of nice because i could meet some of you maybe that are in the area and that want to get your lashes done and i could actually like have a way to like meet people and like talk in person and it's like a very chill setting because you're literally just like laying there on a super comfy bed you're getting your lashes and super pretty and then we can just chat or you can listen to music or you can sleep and nap like whatever the other person wants to do i feel like that's really nice and i can just do my thing i don't know like it sounds like it's like just something that randomly came on my path but th that just feels like it would be really good and i've really been <laughs> i'm trying to be serious and he's just like going crazy 
it feels like I'm in this part of my life where I'm just kind of wanting to explore everything. And like, I don't want to just focus on that. Like, I don't know. Like, I just want to like try everything and see what feels good. So like, I'm like, why not? Like, why would I not do this? Like, she can teach me. She's so good at what she does. I feel like she would do a really great job teaching me. And like, I don't know. I feel like it's just kind of perfect. Like, why not give it a try? I at least want to learn. And if I end up being good and I my shaky hands are good because I have very shaky hands. And I've been getting better from, like, doing my nails. Um, oh, my mom's calling me. Hey, hey, Marcha. What's that? I found it feel good. Because I feel my hair also very comfortable. Oh, this headband covers my bald spot. I'm not ready to show you. I'm just not. Oh, I just can't. I just can't. Like, it's a lot for me. Like, I can't even look at it myself because I'm in disbelief that I have... A bald spot on my head, like I can't. Do it! Do it, bikes! Oh, I love it! Oh my god, I'm so excited for this! This lashing is like kind of random, but like I'm excited to just learn and see. And like maybe some of y'all can get lashed by me, like I don't know. I'm really excited, like I'm excited. To I just want to like able to also connect with people in a way and i feel like with lashing it's such a like chill and like comfortable environment like would be different than doing nails you know and i would still vlog honestly when i do that like it's not like if i start lashing i'm just gonna stop doing this but i would just like have some other things to do as well which i think would be really nice and i mean i love having lashes i cannot go without lashes so i would love to put other girls on and have like my own style I know there's so many new things that I'm always introducing to you guys, but it's because I'm just literally trying everything. <laughs> oh, shit. Catches my interest, and then I'm like, I want to do this, and yeah, I just do that. And I feel like with this, it just all feels like really good, so I'm just going to give it a try. I'm excited. Um, I'm actually getting ready to record a podcast episode because I have not recorded in over a month which was not planned but it just kind of ended up happening that way also because i ended up getting sick and stuff so it's gonna be about my pmdd mental health periods kind of a little bit of everything um i think i might do a different top though i feel like i've worn this many times on camera it's kind of boring but i'm also gonna be wearing a hat so maybe something more casual let's see Anyways, I'm excited to record this episode because I've been wanting to for a while. And I just feel like there's so much to say. And I feel like a lot of people will be able to relate, which is always nice. Um, should I wear this one? Or I got this gifted. I love the fit of it. Like, I love these. I would love to, like, make my own hats, honestly. Like, make one of my own. Like, my own little branding or something. Because I love wearing these kinds of hats. But not every hat has the right fit. I feel like... This could like change it up, but then it's also like maybe it doesn't match the outfit. I don't know. I'm gonna check. Okay, here's the look. Sorry if this footage is shaky, but I just went for this. You're not really gonna see my feet. I think it's just gonna be this. So I think that's cute. I'll probably pop on like a little bit of makeup, and I do actually want to like go through my hair with a straightener, like my extensions, real quick. So let's do that. It's kind of nice to like, pick up the camera again. I haven't done it. Especially when I was sick. Like, I was just not feeling like vlogging at all. Like, I couldn't be on camera. I try to just be, like, more intuitive about it. Like, I don't like to force myself to be on camera because that just makes it not fun for me. But I do still enjoy, like, documenting my life and, like, sharing things with you guys. So I'm just trying to find, you know, a healthy balance and everything. I'm also excited to get back to working out this week. Even though I'm supposed to get my period. I haven't been able to go to the gym because I got COVID, so I kind of like fell out of my routine again. So now it's like, okay, like I'm excited to go and get back into that. I'm thinking maybe tomorrow morning I'm going to hit a leg day. Let me get a hairbrush. It's very gloomy, so I think I'm going to have to work with some lighting today and set things up. And also, I still need to have breakfast. I just realized I've been so bad with having breakfast. Like, 
I don't know. Also, because the strawberries haven't been good, so like I haven't been wanting to eat that. And if I like don't eat that, like what will I eat? <laughs> I'm such a child. If you guys know any other brands that sell hats with this exact fit, let me know because most hats are just too big on my head, but this one is so nice and fitted. I just love it, but it's like all I fucking wear. And now I have the other one with red, but like I kind of want like something different as well, like different colors, maybe different logos on it, like different brands. I don't want to just wear one brand, but this one just has such a good fit and Nothing compares to this hat for real, like. It's been my go-to for a while. I just want to quickly straighten out my hair. I went on a really nice morning walk with Blue and I made some iced coffee, brought it with me. Just trying a lot of new things, but I've been trying a lot of things off camera because I feel like I've, I don't know, I've started to realize that a lot of things I've been doing over the past few years, a lot of it was like, Almost like, not even that it was like for the camera, but like in a way it was, if that makes sense. Because I really haven't had like a different job since I was like 17, 16. Like this has been my thing. And it's like, I don't want to constantly feel like everything I do needs to be like on video. Or like everything I do is like based around my videos and my content. Like I really want to like just start exploring other things and like really experience life. Because not everything is online, you know. Like, I want to do things offline and like real person connections like instead of just only seeing numbers like I want to actually like see people meet people but like in a setting where it's not too much because like you guys know I have social anxiety and I'm not like the craziest like social person but if I feel comfortable like I can be very social and I can have really nice conversations I love just chatting or like even listening to people and giving advice like I love doing that so I'm just gonna go with the flow like I'm trusting the universe that it's bringing me things that belong to me and like either to stay or to teach me something and I'm just like excited to accept everything and not constantly try and chase something that maybe isn't there very very excited very happy and I'm just Taking you guys along with me as always. My hair is done. We can do a little bit of makeup, but I don't really want to do like, anything crazy. Where have I put my phone? Oh, it's there. I honestly just haven't really worn much makeup recently. I don't know. Like, I just kind of like the no makeup look. And I, yeah, that's just it, really. And probably because I haven't had anything to match. I'm going to hit this down. Let's see. Let's get this light going. Ooh! That's bright. So, I'm not taking off the hat. Y'all, I'm not showing you my bald spot. I'm going to start with some powder for under my eyes just to, oh this is better, just so I can like set down the shine a little bit, Charlotte Tilbury, just going to brighten me up a little bit without like using concealer, and this lighting might be like way too bright but it's good enough for me so, yeah I'm excited to record this episode. Make sure to go check it out. My podcast is also on my YouTube if you do want to be able to kind of like help support the pod. If you watch the YouTube videos, I can actually kind of monetize it. So uh, I wanted to do a little bit of bronzer. Just kind of want to use a little brush and like bronze it up a little. Ever since I've had COVID, I've had this disgusting like taste in my mouth. And like it's just so gross. I think this is good enough. Like my hands are so dry. Let's try some. Okay. Let's put on some perfume, y'all. I kind of feel like I haven't been talking to you in a long time. Just because when I was sick, I was so isolated. But it feels good to talk to the camera. <laughs>
We just went on a walk. Period. I just recorded my podcast episode. I actually tried it yesterday and it did not, it was not working for me. Like it was just, it was just bad. So I actually am like redoing it today, but I'm actually really happy with how it turned out this time. So right now I'm just exporting some footage i'm basically going to i am exporting the footage right now so i can put it on my ipad and so that i can edit the episode like maybe at like a coffee shop or like uh somewhere in the sun because it's really nice weather and i don't want to sit here behind my computer i'm really trying to kind of like change that up for me so i think it'll be nice if i go somewhere else to edit so i'm just I just like um, put the audio on top of the video and I'm saving that right now so that I can, I'm just editing the thumbnail right now and then I'm going to leave in a little bit. Um, I have a driver's lesson today, which is exciting because I haven't been since, I mean, I didn't go last week because I had COVID, so, but I'm not positive anymore. I tested yesterday and it was negative, so I should be good. I might still end up wearing like a face mask, but either way, like I don't um, have COVID anymore. Thank God. Just trying to find a good screenshot for the thumbnail. Why does this keep moving? Why we so in the 
Is it because of the camera? I don't know. Like, what is your problem? Like, why are you not eating suddenly? He eats and munches up his breakfast every morning. I put a camera on him and he decides he can't. <laughs> Ja, sowieso vandaag. Ik was al rond zes over de kant. Oeh, oeh. Ik doe gewoon een beetje die beker zo opbakken. En dan doe ik hem tussen mijn tosti. Een beetje sambal, ketchup erop. Wauw. Yeah. 
So excited about this one.
cause I'm gonna need you to explain There's been a whole lot of trying, whole lot of crying, whole lot of telling me I should be dying or be like you But I don't wanna be like you There's been a whole lot of trying, whole lot of crying, whole lot of telling me I should be dying or be like you But I don't wanna be like you Cause I could do, I could do better, I could do, I could do better I spent a whole lot of crying, a whole lot of trying.